Okay, oh my gosh, okay. Oh my god, me first? No, no, no. <laughs> Alright guys, in just about 2 hours and 20 minutes, you're going to be witnessing a breakthrough in the last decade of my life. So what happened? Let me just put on my mask first while we chat because I've just been really tired and my eye bags have been crazy. Well, not eye bags but dark circles. <sighs> Recently, I've just had a trigger to my depressive state. So, the last week has been pretty tough for me to even function as per normal. And as per normal to me means in a space of creation, ideation, possibilities. And the contrast to that is helplessness unable to focus and just being in a space that is not generally considered um, healthy emotionally I guess. Last night was the first day out of my shell ever since the trigger happened. I had met up with a group of acquaintances whom they had arranged a group meeting for anagram discussions. I had agreed to go because I simply love being around people who are in the self-development space. I find that the people there are very genuine, forward-thinking, self-aware, or at least on the journey to be more self-aware. And that would mean that we are usually more open to ideas, more willing to share vulnerably, and also hold space for another person. It makes the interaction a lot safer in that sense. All right, I've said a bunch and the whole point of this video was to share with you guys that I am going to Halloween Horrors Night. Halloween Horror Night. Wait, let me check on that. Ha, huh, Halloween Horror Night. Two weeks ago, I had received an invitation to go to the USS Halloween Horror Night in collaboration with MAC Cosmetics. And let me tell you, my initial reaction was to say no. Why are we doing this again? The last time I went for USS Halloween Horror Night was probably... Oh, isn't that a morning bird usually? <laughs> I would say a decade ago. I don't know how tonight is gonna go at all. Uh, yeah. This should be done by now. Just gonna clean. So during this event, we are able to film since it is a media event. I'm not sure how much I can film and show you guys the whole haunted house, which obviously I don't think I can. To prepare myself for this event, I went to get myself this yesterday at Simlim Square. This would help me to film in the dark and hopefully this works and I'm allowed to bring this in because I... I really don't know if we can. I have decided to wear all black just because if I can blend in and then perhaps they will not target me. Honestly, you know, in order not to be targeted, I realize you have to really look like you're not scared. And I don't think that's something that my body is gonna allow me. Wait, wait, no, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. <laughs> so I'm gonna be one of the targets, I guess. <laughs> I am also wearing jeans. Pants. These are my favorite barrel black jeans from Love Bonito. High waisted. I decided to just put this belt on so it doesn't look too normal as an outfit. So yeah, I might. I actually found this. Um, I actually did find this piece, and this is a backless long sleeve top in an animal print, and I thought I could perhaps wear this or something different. But then I realized since it's backless, would that make me a more vulnerable target? Instead, I thought I could perhaps wear this as a bolero. Let's just keep this on for now first and let's unbox this. I just received this in the mail literally yesterday and I've been waiting for this unboxing with you guys to reveal what's inside. I really was very tempted to open it up. 
But you know what? We're gonna do the first impressions together. So obviously I don't have my makeup now because we're gonna be doing our makeup with whatever is inside here. Wow, that's a literal full set. Gosh, okay, let's dig into what we have. I'm seeing grades, which is important. This first one is ooh, Lock Kiss Ink. And it's a 24 hour lead color in the shade Ruby True. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Okay, I am so excited to try this one. Look at that. It's so great. Next, we have their Studio Fix Fluid Foundation with SPF 15 in shade NC10. It is a 24 hour matte foundation with oil control. So it seems like tonight we're gonna do a long lasting scare proof makeup to last through the night. Let's do it. Ta da! There we go. I'm not sure if this is too light for me though. I actually use NC10 for another, another foundation I have from MAC. So hopefully this is gonna work. The next one, we have another lipstick. And this is from the Maximo Sleek Satin series. And this is in the shade Du Bonnet. Oh, that sounds sexy. What is a Du Bonnet even? Am I even saying it right? This is nice. It's a maroony color. If you can see, the shades are very different. Which one do I want to go with? And then for this one, it is a 24-hour eyeliner. I assume it's in black. Yeah, it's in brush black. Ooh. Yes, I love the brush eyeliners. And two more items. This one is the alcohol free long lasting setting spray look at how pink this packaging is wow okay so we're gonna finish off our makeup with this tonight and lastly it is our connect in color eyeshadow palette it comes in six colors look at that packaging i actually have this in two other palettes I believe and those are in the 12 color ones so now I guess I have another to add to my collection nice okay that would come very handy for tonight these are all a bit more on the mauve brown side palette is called encrypted kryptonite if you're interested in that it comes in shade clear history satin taupe ah powder mode, high tea, on the cloud, and showstopper. I'm gonna be doing my makeup now and I'll check back in with you guys after that. reaching Sentosa and I just want to have a look with you guys on the themes of our haunted houses take a look at the park map haunted houses the first one is called the curse scrolls dynasty of darkness mm. okay curse scrolls curse scrolls sounds like it's a emperor theme imagine guys in Armors scaring us. Um, the next one is Netflix Sweet Home. And then the third one is Singapore's Most Haunted, The Killings. I will assume we would see some old Singapore sites or perhaps old Changi Hospital. So the fourth one is 
Under the Castle by Team Wong Design. The most scary sounding ones to me are the first and second one. And then for the shows, they have Dark Dreams, Night Terrors, Viper Lounge, and this Oculus Ray, which is a party zone. And then there are three scare zones, Vampire Alley, Netherland, and The Lost Kampong. Ooh. We are literally almost turning into Sentosa right now. Ta-da, this is where we are. Uh-huh, uh-huh. At the very last minute, I decided to add on this blood tears. Let's pray that we'll come out alive. Obviously we will, but you know what I mean. Alright, we are now finding our way to USS. And we just got a first get out of this car park. I wanted to show you guys my haunted house outfit. So this is my haunted house outfit. I decided to wear all black just so we can camouflage. <laughs> and then I made sure to wear this sleeves just so that um, no one can touch me. <laughs> I'm not vulnerable anywhere. <laughs> and anyway, they probably can't touch my neck because it's illegal. So, um, and I have my backpack ready so it's comfortable for me throughout the whole exploration. And then to make sure we can run, I have spot shoes! <laughs> Bye! Oh, I see, I see. Ah! No! No! <laughs> okay, we are now entering Universal Studios. <laughs> Today is closed for media events, so let's go. The only thing I realize is wearing a tube top is probably not the best idea because it's constantly sleeping down. Okay, so we are now for our first show because apparently this is the last show of the night and it's 7.30 which is kind of surprising because this is the entrance time but okay, so we're gonna watch Dark Dreams I'm not excited for this at all even though I'm laughing No, it's still scary Last night, so 
so this reminded me of that. Yellow. Yeah, so you're ready to eat. Eight o'clock. Yeah. Okay. okay. I am sweating all over and I was basically screaming through the whole thing 
Okay guys, I'm going to go into the vampire alley which is a scare zone and I'm already really scared Yeah, so uh, there's no choice, but you have to enter. Game over. 